Welcome to my channel. So today we are going to be doing image enhancement. And image enhancement is just improving the appearance of an image to enhance visual interpretation. So we are going to um, go first to the discrete DRA and we are going to set the parameters as shown. So just follow those steps and set the, dis the DRA properties, then click OK. Okay, so we are going to be performing histogram matching. And when I talk about histogram matching, I mean that it's a um, correction method that reduces haze. So to perform histogram matching, we'll need two, we'll need two sets of imagery. So we'll need um, to use a Landsat 8, and then we'll use Landsat 7 to perform the matching. So Landsat 8 will be matched to Landsat 7. So go to, as you can see in the options, there are a number of image enhancing techniques, but um, we are going to be doing histogram matching. So basically in histogram matching, um, we identify the dark pixels, and then we look at the DN values for these dark pixels, and then we match them to the corresponding pixels. So... Let's go about it. Go to the radiometric, then go to histogram match, select it, then first the first input file will of course be the Landsat 8 that you had layer stacked. Uh -huh. The second input file will be the Landsat 7. So in case you don't have, you'll go and download Landsat 7 from USGS. The same, same way we had downloaded Landsat 8. If you do not know how to download Landsat data, I have a tutorial. I leave it in the description box so that you can go ahead and watch it first. So let's give the output file a name and a location. So let's enable that. Use all bands because we want to use all of the bands to match. And then leave all the other parameters as default and click OK. Now we are good to go. So let's give that process um, time to run. And I'll just hasten the process a little bit. So let's go quickly there. And then once the process is done, we'll be able to view our final output. And then now we can close that and open the raster image. So we are going to open it in a new 2D view. So add um, 2D view. And then let's add the raster. It's just a repetitive process. Add the raster layer. Remember where you had saved it? Add it. Okay. Now let's fit the layer to the window. So fit it to window. Good. So um, let's lock that up so that they're in the same um, same position, same size. I don't know. And as you can see. On your left you have the image before enhancement and then on the right after enhancement so after enhancement and reduction of haze the atmospheric haze this is our result so as you can see um, there is now the, imp the image has been improved and now it's easier to make visual interpretation so that you can understand the imagery so other methods of enhancement can be such as contrast stretching yeah or spatial filtering apologies once again if there is any background noise 
so now that we have that i think we are good to go what is left to do is to compare the values the dn values that you had mentioned as well as the image histogram so um, to view that we'll just open the image metadata for the both of them we can start with the first one so let's view the histogram yeah so this is the before histo actually this is the after histogram let's view the before histogram to see the difference so histogram so as you can see now the histogram is uh, matched now to the Landsat 7 histogram and if you look at the dn values let us also view the other one and if you scroll to the bottom and to the side Yeah, I think we'll just use the histogram for interpretation.